Hey, this week we are talking about the way that God gives us everything that we need in order to grow and thrive in the way that he wants us to. This is from our sermon on Daniel chapter 1. We have what we need is what we call that. So all week long we'll be talking about some themes from that. Uh, from this week's message. Um, I just want to read to you uh, Daniel 1, uh, verse 17. It says this, God gave these four young men an unusual aptitude for understanding every aspect of literature and wisdom. And God gave Daniel the special ability to interpret the meanings of visions and dreams. And here's what we can learn um, from this, that God equips us, he gives us he enables and empowers us with the skills and the wisdom that we need, even in challenging situations. Um, I have uh, I have a couple of toolboxes in my garage, and obviously they're filled with everything, and they're filled with things that I've picked up over the years. One of the um, probably the oldest tools that I have is um, is a little is a little tool that that you um, that you use when you want to rotate and you want to open up the brake calipers on a mid 1980s Saab and I have a Saab 900 actually and I have that tool because very early on um, in our marriage early 90s like 1991 92 I had um, I had a Saab 900s and I had to um, I had to replace the CV joint um, on this car and one of the tools that I needed to find was something that would rotate back and open up the brake calipers and it was a special tool designed just for that. Now, like on the cars that I've had since then, I can just like use a C-clamp and I know I'm getting really nerdy and really technical, but it was a special tool that I had. And my toolbox is full, filled with all of the tools that I've accumulated over the years um, that gives me that give me exactly what I need to do the job that I have. And God, in the same way, provides us with the tools that we need to navigate the, our lives. And those tools are the church. Those tools are one another. God provides us with what we need in order to be able to do that. So this week and today, I want you to think about just the skills and the abilities that God has given you. I want you to reflect on those things and consider how you can use what God has given you um, to serve him this week. Well, how are you going to allow yourself to be used in a special way to be used by God to grow and to build his kingdom, to pour into the lives of others? That's what I'm praying about for you today. Love you, praying with you, praying for you, and I look forward to catching up with you um, tomorrow when we talk about the importance and the value and the sufficiency of God's word. See you then.